Okay, another lunchtime, more XCOM. You know the drill by now. Oh, Intel. Oh, I want to go and get that because I do want some Intel. Let's first finish me. We'll find out. We'll find out what the game throws in. Oh, here we go. So we've analyzed the giant advent teddy bear. Oh, no, this is the codex. Oh, this is like, oh, we need to skull jack the codex. And I believe I now understand why. The elders appear to be afflicted with an aggressive form of tissue degeneration. Yeah, we're old and shriveling. Yeah. So we're going to make ourselves sexy psychic anime boy bodies. Sounds like our job just got a whole lot easier. As with most things involving this adversary, it's never quite that simple. The elders have been aggressively searching for a cure to their condition for centuries. Each time they encountered a new species, they procured what genetic information and material they required and moved on to the next world. Until now. I believe they Yeah, basically the elders really like humans. We're making progress. They're going to harvest humans to uh now oh, those are all the oh the shadow chambers Really annoying. Oh, upgrade. There we go. Shadow chamber upgraded. Oh, that's just done. Okay. I thought it was going to take some time at least, but fine. Uh, yeah, basically the elders really like humans. They're going to harvest us and turn us into... And they're going to use human genetic material to turn... To give themselves new bodies. Uh, which we will now probably... Oh, cool. He is now finished. I've, yeah. So I've got two fully trained psychics, which is good. All right. We're reading you. Uh, cool. We've now made contact with every region. There is literally no point in me getting this, uh, <laughs> getting me this region bonus now, because I've researched everything. I've got no literally nothing to do. Uh, let's go and get the intel. Avenger. Now okay, we've built a defense matrix for, you know, <laughs> whatever, sure. So now if uh, we ever get attacked, we can throw someone in here. Uh, yeah, well, let's actually just do that. Oh no, it's a gremlin, so it's all over the place. Um, is everyone recovered from their wounds? Yep, yeah, okay. Let's go and put this person in the uh, defense matrix. Just in case we ever get invaded again, which is so unlikely, we've got four extra turrets just in case we ever have to do a uh, defense mission again. Sure. Okay, payday. He's happy. Oh, that's so much money. Uh, we're not gonna. We're not gonna do the uh, intel reveal. Oh, so many resources, but we really want this intel. All uh, insanity, I guess. These things—they're such a backup. They're like my third psychic, and like I just have no use for them really. <laughs> Forty-one intel—that's really good. Uh, right. I've just said, oh, let's let's get some intel. But let's maybe quickly uh, go and see what's at the black market. Even though I don't need anything at the black market. We'll go and look at it anyway. Yeah, we don't need any of this. I mean, the superior scope is nice, but we don't need it. Um, I mean, we're actually probably going to sell some stuff, honestly. Um, what do we not need? I can't remember what we never, what we don't need. Um, oh, we don't need berserker corpses. We don't need archon corpses. Mm. 
We don't need chrysalid corpses. We don't need two exosuits. Um, we don't need spider suits. Don't need laser sights. We'll keep basic scopes. Uh, tracer round, smoke beacon, raid suit, advanced scope. Yep, that's all right. Sell, sell all that. Even though I don't need the money. Uh, things now just kind of waiting around for a mission to show up because then we need to go skulljack a codex. I uh, could go and do a facility mission, I suppose, because I think then a codex is pretty much guaranteed. Oh, high priority mission. Uh, we get an engineer. Oh, we get some um, intel as well, which is good. Uh, eight enemies, elite officer, elite shield bearer, codex, archon, gatekeeper. Easy peasy. Easy peasy. Uh, yep. Uh, oh no, we're not taking the rookies. Oh god, all this. Make utility items available. Make armor available. Make weapons available. Alright. Bulldozer. Slasher. Blue screen. Machine. Brainstorm. Sucker punch. Oh, and all this all this fun bit now of having to go through and do all their gear again. Load out. War suit. Uh, blast launcher. Right, we actually definitely want flashbangs for this so we can stun a codex. Uh, wraith suit. Storm gun. And battle scan. Oh no, AP rounds, that's what we want. Jack and battle scanner. Got no way of increasing her speed, I don't think. Oh, I need to give her a better gun as well. She's got a basic gun. Um, yep. Yeah, I haven't got one that increases speed, which is what I really want. Uh, let's take the plasma blaster this time. No, I love the sh I love the shred st shred storm is so good. Uh, flashbangs have just been consistently good through the whole game, really. I mean, I suppose I could actually be spending money so I don't have to keep shifting utility items around, really. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. Scanner. Oh, red suit does improve movement. Oh, you know what? Maybe, just maybe. What if? Because we want to be able to have the specialist be able to really like run forward and like skulljack a codex so I think the wraith suit just to give her the extra mobility might be worth it
All right, cool. Yes, we're all good with that. It's actually going to set up, sorry, you know, we get the uh, engineer whatever, but the intel is what's really going to set us up really nicely. So actually we kind of want to keep the codex alive, I think, for long as well. We want to clear out as many enemies as possible, come back to the codex, scourge out the codex, which spawns an avatar, and then we just kill the avatar. Because then that gives us an avatar corpse doing the avatar autopsy, basically then unlocks the last mission. And that's like the point of no return. The resistance is asking for our help in rescuing a VIP currently being held by Advent in this region. We're moving in to neutralize any alien forces protecting the transport vehicle. Lock down the AO and secure the target package. So this mission might be getting us set up for the uh, for the final mission. I would like to get Jessica leveled up to Colonel because I want to go into the Radio Tower mission with Jessica like fully leveled up. So might do the facility missions just to try and get her up to Colonel level because Jessica deserves like to go on that final mission. Right, so we've got a rescue a VIP from, um... Okay, it's just that all the codex is right next to it with the Archon and something else. Okay. Right, so we go nice and slow. As always, we go nice and slow. There's board right. Uh... Right, so we know, like, a codex is over there. Understood. Moving out. On the move. Right, we want to keep the psychic down here so we can use stasis on the codex so we don't accidentally kill it. Because <laughs> I do not want to keep doing missions. <laughs> I would like to be able to get the codex in this mission, but we'll see how that goes. Um, do we chuck out a battle scanner? Let's get the heavies upstairs. This should be no risk. Closing on target position now. Understood. Right, she can double move. And still got an overwatch, which is good. Oh, right, we want to deal with them first. Definitely, definitely want to deal with them first. I mean, if possible, I'm not going to go out of my way to deal with them first. Okay. Understood. Moving out. All 
Right, that should be fine. That shouldn't be a reveal. So what's down here? Uh, that is two Archons and a Codex. So the Archons are a little bit of a problem, maybe. I think... Maybe go and try and deal with those Advent guys. Ooh, what's my one of the hack options? Because it, it could be really good. The hack options are sometimes like your whole squad gets, you basically get a double go. Which is, uh, oh, squad immediately gains concealment. <gasps> so, oh, what we could do. We could take some shots, do that hack, everyone gets concealment again. That's very tempting. Heading there now. Commander, that codex provides the ideal opportunity to infiltrate the Advent network. We will need to move in with the Skulljack to initiate the process. Right, so we won't go Overwatch up here. Right, okay, let's 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 plan this. Let's not be silly. Maybe let's run and gun with him, so he can actually get a shot off at the Advent guys. Okay. Right, so I'm not going to stick these on Overwatch because that might alert them, maybe? I've got the heavies up top who can flashbang if it all goes tits up. So, let's do this. That should be guaranteed kill on the officer. Alright, good. And you drop some loot, which is always good. Right. They're going to act. That's fine. We knew they were going to do that. Okay. Right, we don't want to shoot the Codex. We want to get shots on this Archon. Alright, hasn't killed it. That's fine. That's okay. Right, we can kill this one, hopefully. Okay, still up. Not wonderful. Adjusting aim. All right, I think we maybe don't stasis the codex. Let's drop a flashbang on everything. That kills the Archon. Stuns the other one. Disorientates the codex. And also then it's lower health, which I think makes it easier to Skulljack. Stasis on the Codex. So it's not going anywhere. Is that everyone who's acting now? Yes, that's everyone who's there. So now... System infiltration in progress. Hack this. And hopefully, hopefully, conceal the squad. Because what it was, I think it was like 90% chance. Yes. So the whole squad is concealed again. 
So now they've got a, I don't think they were in sight range of anything. So now we all get to see what, So now these enemies have to now spend their turn like trying to find me again. he just flying as normal yeah okay so we all st we're still hidden right can blue screen get up to the codex and skull jacket this turn she can you know what I think we just do that and oh 70% chance though I think we just do it and deal with whatever happens. <laughs> now this is going to spawn an avatar. I've got the whole team still on standby, so I think we're okay. Okay, that's fine. Summoned the sexy, sexy psychic anime boy. Commander, I believe we are seeing something entirely new. An alien species that has so far managed to Oh, everyone's got individual concealment. <gasps> well. Alright, 100% chance this kills. Let's do that. You're not scary, Mr. Avatar. Just twatted you for seven damage. Oh, and then they teleport. I forgot they did that. What the f it jumped to a new position as soon as it took damage. Really not an issue, though. This kills. This almost 100% kills. Yep. Excellent, excellent. There is a gatekeeper out here as well somewhere. So we still want to go a little... Still want to be a little bit cautious. Seventy-three percent. Yeah. Puny guards. You can't handle me. They're on to me. We're gonna just keep her there, I think. Machine goes on Overwatch. Get brainstorm. I know to here. And Overwatch. That was a very successful turn. Right, there is still a gatekeeper out there though. Good copy. Moving on target. Oh, she's still concealed. <gasps> of course, everyone is still individually concealed, which is amazing. Who is still, she's still concealed. Right, I think we have to throw out a battle scanner. Because I'm imagining there's going to be something down this way. Yeah. But that's fine. Right. Where can we go 
to drop a proxy mine that doesn't reveal. Mm. Roger that. Still not ideal. Oh, he's got the blaster launcher though. Alright, let's just move up, let's not reveal, wait for the reveal on their turn. Demolish my own cover, which is not wonderful. Oh yeah, we really want to get lots of damage. Oh, come on! Why, why is the gatekeeper so hard to hit? It's a giant ball! That's fine, we can deal with these. Oh, is that the gear? I forgot there was gear there. Oh well, it's fine, we can deal with all this. Right, so... She's still concealed. Uh, oh, I thought she'd shoot again because she's got Salvo. Oh well. Oh no, I think Salvo's launching grenade or I'm on the move. or a. Uh, Using a heavy weapon. Uh, we're just going to do this blaster launcher and just get rid of these two. On your teal. Oh, Archon is still up. I was not expecting that. Uh, let's get a run and gun in. Oh, just to go one extra square, but we'll oh well, it is what it is. Who's keeping score? And let's go soul fire. Just apps, hundred hundred percent kill it. Transport. Hopefully, get a tasty bonus out of it. Uh, sh sure. Let's get a lead on a facility. Why not? Can he now leave the guy in the truck? Oh, Alright. Uh, okay, just move up. Oh, I've still got to open the door, apparently. What's over there? That's lazy. Where do I need to get to? 
there. Well, it's still quite a fair distance away. So, let's so. go up to there and overwatch. Start moving the heavies down. I think we just, I think we can risk just a run. We got okay. Yep, yeah. let's just get them all running. And hopefully, we can get everything everyone back next turn. They're probably gonna drop reinforcements now this turn. Yeah. Uh, can I get the VIP out this turn? Yes, so we 100% do that. Throw down a proxy mine. Where are they dropping in? Oh, they're actually, they're all the way over there. I think we just move up as much as possible and just like, and just leave next turn, like not even deal with it. She can, of course, move and get free Overwatch, which is great. Yeah, so we we at least get two shots on them, whatever's coming in. Uh, what are they dropping? Heavy a mech, probably. Probably a heavy mech. No, just normal dudes. That's fine. That's literally zero threat. Because uh, we can just leave next turn. None of them are going to go on Overwatch. I, pr I might even kill like one or two of them now, depending how this goes. Okay, that's a miss. Whatever. Oh, okay, that's fine. Whatever. Don't need to hit them, just need to leave. Because they're just going to spend the whole turn moving anyway, so it's fine. Can we get her on? Right, Machine is the furthest away. Oh, she actually can't make it this turn. So we might have to do a little bit of fighting. Right, let's just get her in here. I'm trusting you here. And take a shot. And just leave. It it's fine. Uh, let's get machine to here. here I come. Oh, actually, let's clear people out of the way because I want to actually do a shred storm cannon. Uh, let's get around. slash around to here. I don't think that's actually then a shot, is it, on anything? No. Well, let's hang on. Let's uh, let's see what we can do. Machine, it's just going to do Shredstorm Cannon. Or let's get both of them. Oh, because the Shield Bearer is off some other way. Whatever, we just do this. And what's left? The Shield Bearer. Um, 
stasis, <laughs> and then we just and then we just have to, we just don't have to deal with him. Yeah, we can just get everyone out now. Not everyone out. We can get most of them out. Perfect. Perfectly done. Status confirmed. Mission accomplished. Operation God Saga. Cool. So, managed to hack the codex, which is great. Um, this also like sets the doom clock back about about like four, I think, when you kill an avatar for the first time. Which is pretty good. step away for a moment there sorry if you were stuck watching the squad just kind of congratulate themselves right uh, I probably don't have time to do another full mission we can do some like, admin and stuff I guess it's probably these missions getting kind of, kind of more complicated and so it takes a little longer another success beyond yep all everyone did well uh, yeah, we've got Intel, we've got a Codex Brain, Facility Lead, oh, which I have to research, and the Avatar Corps. Another impressive effort, Commander. My expectations were high, and yet you have exceeded them. Oh yeah, where can we put him in this new, the new engineer? You know what, we'll just, we'll just stick him here, just, why not? He can just stay in there forever now. <laughs> um, I've just got an empty room, which I just don't need to do anything with. Oh, you know what? I've got money to spend. Let's just... <laughs> These two abilities, which I've not needed the whole game, but we'll get them anyway. Um, excellent. All right, we're not going to do the avatar autopsy because that locks us into the end game. Um, oh, we oh we've got to finish doing the supply drop, and you know what? The lab is currently idle. We're wasting valuable time and resources by not conducting any research. Well, you have Please nothing. Consider providing us with a directive as soon as possible. But you have Ready nothing to, to research. <laughs> you've researched everything, Tygen. You've come. Up, you've invented plasma guns. You don't need any more. You're fine. Uh, what's the experimental grenade? Acid bomb. Okay. Incendiary bomb. Okay. Why not? One more. Gas bomb. Okay. Those. Are, I mean, just none of them are as good as, as proxy mines, are they? Uh, do I build another wraith suit? Another war suit? Do I really need to? Like, I'm fine having like a split of like two, two, two on the team. 
I guess. Um, oh, that's what I was going to build. I was going to build extra battle scanners and stuff so I don't have to keep moving utility items around. Fly back to HQ. For the Eastern US precinct. Uh, complete the Sonic Gate Shadow Project. Welcome, Commander. Um, we don't need any of these people. Right, so. Okay. No, that's the archive. Uh, Sonic Gate. I've got to complete everything else. Right, okay, Sonic Gate. Oh, can I rush research on it? Because I'm at HQ. Welcome, Commander. No, uh, rush research is at the black market, isn't it? I mean, let's just go and see if we can do that. Avenger plotting new course. No, can't rush research. Whatever, that's fine. Uh, supplies don't need don't need any of this. Saw about the point now in the game where I've kind of done everything. I said we've got two uh, two facilities. You know what? Why not? Let's just go take let's just go take down the facility. What's the heavy mech, elite lancer, sector pod, elite shield bearer, elite trooper? Yeah, why not? Let's just get set up to take down another facility. Take the rookies out on a on a day out to destroy a facility. They've not managed to do that yet. Let's get this uh, avatar project like all the way down to one. Right, clear the squad. We want to make weapons available and make armor available. So Jessica is... Oh, she's slowly a captain. Maybe this... Uh, maybe these missions will... Will get her promoted. We'll see. Oh, yes. Yeah, give him the advanced will. Alright, it doesn't need any of this. Uh, whatever, just one of the rifles, it doesn't matter. And about the scanner. And a movie beacon. One of the rifles, it doesn't matter. <coughs> uh, give him a skull jack. And a battle scanner. Give Jessica a raid suit. Uh, yeah, scope, magazine, autoloader. That's the one. And the arm piercing rounds? Where are they? Don't have them. Oh, because they're on Slasher. Oh, it was apparently... Okay, they count as a utility item, I guess. Um, oh, we'll give her the tracer rounds. Why not? Make sure she definitely hits. Uh, 
I give him a war suit. Storm gun. Shredstorm. Oh, the Hellfire Projector. Uh, Shredstorm Cannon. And... I'll just give... Uh, why not? Give him a Flashbang Grenade. Why not? I don't know. What are all these? What are all these fun ones? Acid Bomb. Name it Beacon. Sure. Take the rookies out to destroy a facility. And that'll get set up ready for next time. I think now that like an avatar's been killed, like codexes don't show up now because basically codexes now serve no purpose. They might still show up. I don't remember them showing up, but I've been wrong before. So we'll get this up and then we will pick up on it next time. But yes, we are very definitely in the end game now. Because we do the sign at gate research, which is five days, and then the avatar, which is the avatar project is five days, and that locks us into So really, while waiting for that. I think we just take the rookies and just like go on a <laughs> go on a rampage, just take down all the facilities with the rookies. Minus one five. Target coordinates are locked in. Move to designated position and place the X4 charge. I I saw some enemies there. I saw some enemy health bars around there. Um oh, this map is very familiar. This is very similar to the one I just did last time, which uh which had uh, Andrew on it. Oh, well. right. Well, we will pick up on that next time, and uh, I'm sure, I'm sure it will go absolutely fine.